Bummer, another Hollywood couple has called it quits, as we've just learned Jennifer Hudson and her fiancé, David Otunga, have parted ways after 10 years together. They have been in the process of ending their relationship for a number of months, Jennifer's rep told HollywoodLife.com in a statement. Today, Jennifer requested and received a protective order against her ex-fiancé. Jennifer's actions are solely taken in the best interest of their son. Please respect her privacy at this time. David's attorney, Tracy Rizzo, told TMZ, David Otunga has been trying to negotiate the terms of an amicable parenting agreement with Miss Hudson for several weeks now. However, when it became apparent to Miss Hudson that Mr. Otunga would be the parent granted residential care of the child, as a result of Mr. Otunga being the child's primary caregiver while Miss Hudson pursues her career all over the world, Miss Hudson decided to file a meritless petition for order of protection in an effort to gain an unfair advantage in the custody dispute. As a result of Mr. Rotunga's career in the WWE, Miss Hudson felt that she could give an award-winning performance in court to portray herself as the victim. Mr. Rotunga has never abused or harassed Miss Hudson or their son. As you may recall, Jennifer and David share a lot of history together. The former pro wrestler proposed in September 2008 after less than a year of dating, and they welcomed their son, David Daniel Otunga Jr., into the world just a year later in August 2009. Furthermore, just a month after he proposed, the American Idol contestant's mother, Darnell Donerson, and her brother, Jason Hudson, were found dead after they were shot in a Chicago home. Her seven year old nephew, Julian King, was also found dead but his body was discovered in the back seat of a car several days later. The culprit, unfortunately, was none other than Jennifer's own brother-in-law, William Balfour, who was eventually convicted of all three murders in 2012. 12.